Hey, what's up guys? Michael Smith from GGTV here um, and today we're going to be playing Champions Online. Um, so Champions Online is a superhero based MMORPG. Um, so the concept of the game is to create your own superhero um, and venture out into, the, into a comic book world um, where you'll complete missions and alerts uh, and etc. Things like that. Just, just the general MMORPG style game. Um, it's a fairly old game, uh, it came out in 2009, um, but it's still still pretty popular. Um, it's got, got a reasonably large player, ba player base, um, so as you can see I've already made a character here, um, which is obviously the Incredible Hulk, but with my own sort of twist on it. Um, but today we're going to be creating our own hero. So one of the biggest features about this game is the character creation. So what, what we have here is the power selection screen. Um, so as you can see there's fire, archery and munitions. But the thing is, I wouldn't really class these as powers, more like weapons, which sort of is a bit weird. Because I wouldn't really class archery as a power, it's more of a skill. So, but anyways, hey whatever you guys think. Um, so you've got the ranged, which is essentially just step back and fire. Um, you've got the tank, who run in and take all the damage and all the attention off the mobs. You've got melee, which is another sort of DPS class where you're more up close and personal. Hybrid um, is sort of a mixture between all of them, I think. I think I think it's all of them. Um, and you've got support which are your healers. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and pick melee um, using a single sword. I mean you can go, you can dual wield or you can go single but um, I'm going to go single. Um, you may have also recognised that all these powers here which are blanked out are powers that you can actually purchase using cryptic points. Um, or if you've got a gold account then you get all these powers unlocked but because I refuse to pay um, monthly then we're just going to go with the free to play powers so we're going to go and play, pick um, the single sword um, and we're going to go and pick default so we're going to start from scratch um, so as you can see um, we're going to start off with the head um, you have heads and hairs, full mask, hats and helmets, half helmets full helmets, face masks and armor, hoods, and all of these ones here. You can, you can, you can beat animals as well, um, which is quite a cool thing. Um, but this is just like your main selection here. So we're just gonna keep it simple and go heads and hairs. Um, you don't really need, I, 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 me personally, I don't need to touch any of these parts, but you can make your, your character have metal skin, leather, bear, but we're just gonna go with bear. Um, you can also buy customizable parts for your, he uh, for your hero with cryptic points again, but our, I'm not going to pay for any of those. So we're just going to click hide and remove them. Um, so we're going to go to hairstyle, pick our hair. We're going to go a bit wild and go with crazy spiked. Um, and as you can see, there's quite a lot of quite a lot of colours to pick from so it doesn't exactly like leave you with a limited option so, you, so you've got different shades of each colour which is nice um, but we're going to go with a bright orange um, and you can also pick like the tints in your hair as well which is quite cool um, so for those who have multicoloured hair well then this game's for you um, we're going to go and pick the eyes and we're going to go with some some sort of evil looking eyes um, so yeah um, some, of the, some of the items that you pick in the character creation screen um, will have the glow feature which means that part of that colour will glow um, so yeah so you can see there in the eye we have a lot of glowing colours so we're gonna go and pick 
um, a bright yellow and then we're gonna see there we go again there's another another glow feature um, we're just gonna go and pick, pick black because we're gonna make him look quite evil <laughs> um, so there you go we've got, we've got his eyes sorted um, I think I've got, I've got black tints in my hair so I'm gonna go and change that I don't know if that I don't know if that changes anything, but no, it doesn't. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go and make a mask. So yeah, there's quite a lot of variety for masks. Um, so your character will always look unique compared to other characters in the game, which is quite nice. Um, so yeah, we'll do this. So we've got white there, we'll have a bit of red in there as well, um, and we'll go to the mouth. I want to have a full mask, so I'm going to try try and make it look like a full mask. Yeah, there we go. We'll pick that one, and we'll pick white, so there. Looks like a cool, cool mask there. Um, side. Yeah, so there's quite, quite a lot of quite a lot of options to pick um, but we're just gonna go with this one keep it simple I don't want it too big and I'll pick red as well I'll pick that red there we go um, eyebrows we're gonna need to change his eyebrows colors the eyebrow colors because uh, you look a bit stupid with brown eyebrows and ginger hair we're gonna go to the chest area now. Um, so, uh, again, you've got your main options here. I'll zoom out a bit. Um, where you can have tightened skin, have your chest wear, full shirts, jackets. Um, you can also have like shoulder guards that are also integrated into your chest. Um, and robotic arms there for anyone who wants to be a sort of tech looking dude. But we're gonna go with jackets. Um, and I'm gonna change the color to all black because I like black. I'm gonna keep them dark. Um, we'll change the kind of jacket, so we're gonna go with we're gonna go with this one because we're gonna go. We're gonna try and make him look like he's wearing some sort of robe with a jacket. Make him look a bit samurai, sort of ninja thing going on. Um, we'll customize the jacket which is also another feature in the game where you can customize the items to make them look a bit sort of more unique to other players so if like a player picked this and they had the jacket they could have patched whereas I'm gonna go with a gradient so it's nice to know that you can also change the look of items rather than being stuck to one default item. Um, so I can customize the inside and outside colors of the jacket, but on the inside we're gonna go and make it white. Oh wait, no. We're gonna make this bit white and we'll make this bit black. Um, we'll go, we don't want braces, I don't want shoulder pads, but I'll go and show you anyway. Um, you can get quite a lot of shoulder pads in there, but we're not gonna go and pick that, so we'll skip ahead there. Um, and we'll go straight to hands. Um, you can also pick gloves, you can pick claws and skeleton hands and all that stuff but we're just going to keep them looking a bit human. Um, and we'll go with the legs uh, and because I said that we're going to make robes so we'll go with long robes. Um, and we'll, we'll change them so that they're a lot longer. Um, so there we go, we've got our robes there. We'll change the feet um, to, to sort of make it all black. Uh, I can't remember which kind of shoes I picked last time when I made this character, but we'll uh, We'll try, 
Well, I don't want to wear on trainers because that would look a bit silly. I'll go with these ones. I think. <laughs> I really can't remember, but we'll, we'll we'll just keep that. We'll keep that for now. Um, as I say, we can go back later on and we can change it if we need to. Um, we've got leg accessories, so you can pick from all these here. Um, not much selection here, but we'll uh, we'll go with the katana. He's going to use a sword, but we we'll want to have it on the left side, so we'll pick left and then katana there. So. I'm going to end this video here guys because I'm on to 10 minutes already. Um, I'll upload this one and then uh, make sure you check out episode 2 where we'll continue uh, through the character customization. Um, please feel free to like and subscribe if you like my videos. If not then that's fair enough. Um, so till next time.